You know, it may be freezing outside, but it takes prolonged frigid cold, as Chris mentioned, for the ground to really freeze up. But after having a high number of water mains and pipes freeze throughout our region last winter, communities are already getting ahead of that problem. ABC 6 News reporter Steph Kroc reports. A couple hundred thousand dollars total, um, and we're talking replacement of the mains that broke, uh, replacing the street, and then um, assisting the homeowners with uh, backfeeding their residences with water. Last year was a costly winter for the city of Lanesboro. Pipes froze across town, leaving many with no running water. We were in the high teens. Um, I know at one point there was uh, in excess of 20 homes that, that were frozen. Of course, they weren't alone. Last year there was some places eight to nine feet deep the frost was or in this area. Scott Wiederhoft is with Roto-Rooter Plumbing in Rochester. He says they alone had more than 300 frozen pipe calls, meaning across the county there were certainly more. I'm sure it was in the thousands. So as we're on the heels of a bitter cold week, communities are getting ahead of that issue. Any sub-zero temperatures, uh, we'd like for them to kind of monitor their water and take its temperature. If, it, if it's below 38 degrees, then they need to run a pencil-sized stream. They're asking residents to start running their water if it gets close to freezing. The city of Lanesboro will even help its residents with the water bill if they tell them they're doing it in advance. That's the benefit of noti notifying us ahead of time is that uh, we're able to then take an average of the water usage and, and um, deduct that from their bills um, so that, that it's not an exponential charge uh, for us or for them. An option with fewer headaches and fewer costs. We're more proactive this year rather than reactive that we were last year, so yeah. it helps. In Lanesboro, Steph Kroc, ABC 6 News. Since the city of Lanesboro is helping with the water bill, they won't be thawing out your frozen pipes this winter. Now, the main up to the curb is the city's responsibility. Anything beyond that is going to be the responsibility of the homeowner. If you're concerned about pipes freezing, contact your local utility company. Yeah. And that can be a mess, so you oh, definitely yes, want to stay ahead of the game. Very there. expensive mess.